more comedy for sure. And a lot more action, I guess. A lot. Uh, <laughs> the episodes grow. I mean, it really becomes, you know, um, deep into, you really get to learn a lot more about the characters, their emotions, um, what they feel and what they think about the world around them. So, you know, we dive deeper into the characters and where they are. And mm. Sebastian just stands there and looks out the window longing. Mm. <laughs> yes, longing being one of the words for it. <laughs> I, I, I think I think trauma as a theme is definitely obviously a part of our story as well. I, I, it feels that it's probably a big part of the story of any of these superheroes. I think Kevin went on to say one time that we never really we, we sometimes maybe take for granted what the emotional impact of like these things that that have happened to to all of the, all of the superheroes per se is and maybe the shows focus on that a lot more but we're we're also just a very different show yeah like they both have trauma and 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 uh war stories and war experiences that they you know kind of bond over and and understand help understand that you know each other better um no i feel like it's comparable um my biggest fear going into this was we wouldn't be able to do the things on television that we were doing in the movie theaters. The, the scope and scale of that last scene of Endgame kind of changed the game when it comes to film. And I was afraid we wouldn't be able to capture that on television, but I feel like Kari uh, did a great job putting together um, mm -hmm. something for the small screen that we, uh, that we see literally has redefined what we can do on television. So I don't think it's bigger by any means than the movies, but I think it's comparable to what we've done in the movies. Um, Sharon Carter is, is obviously one of the other characters, like other characters that are going to be in our show that are going to get um, to, to sort of be understood a little bit more. And again, we don't know, we don't know too much about what happened with Sharon right after, after the movies and so on, you know, she was in exile and so on. So um, this is definitely going to focus on her as well. And um, it's a really badass character at all agent 13. It's she's always been a badass character in the comic books, you know, and I think she's finally uh, really going to get her day in court here. So we're partners, co-workers, not necessarily a team. No. We look damn good, though. <laughs>